RHS. I'm Jacob Simpson. And I'm Kelsey Blackburn. And this is your Daily Dose for Tuesday, May 20th, 2014. The music department at RHS is working hard at preparing for its events throughout the month of May. On May 21st, the annual Mayfest concert will be taking place. Here's Abby Mead with some more info. On May 21st, the vocal department will be holding their annual concert, Mayfest. All right, what's the purpose of Mayfest? Mayfest, uh, originally, years ago when it started, showcased the whole school. It showcased the vocal department, the instrumental department, the art department, uh, the wood shops, and all of that. And through the years, it kind of fizzled down to just the music department. And so this is the annual spring concert for the vocal music department, where it showcases all of our kids from the beginning class to the higher level, all the way to the higher level classes. Okay. What's the most fun part about this event? Um, my favorite part and the most fun part for me is that we all get to dance and sing, and it's the end of the year, like, hurrah for the music department. People should come to the concert because it's a fun event. You hear all different types of music. There's solos, there are duets, and there's obviously the acapella choir, concert choir, and chorus. Mayfest is super cool because you get to see everyone showcase their different talents and it's really fun. It's not like boring old classical music, like it's fun, upbeat, everyone dresses up. <laughs> and like you get to see like how everyone reacts with one another and like the true colors of like the music department. It's really cool. Come, Come to Mayfest! Mayfest. The concert will feature various acts performing a variety of talents. I hope to see you there. Wow, that sounds like fun. Go out and support the RHS music department at these events. In club news, if you want to make a positive difference in our school, ask Mrs. Bowler or Mrs. Zaleski if you're interested in joining the PBIS student group. NHS is holding a Kiss a Senior Goodbye fundraiser starting today and will continue during the whole week during lunches. You can buy a candy gram for $1 to send to any senior. They will be delivered on Wednesday the 21st and Friday the 23rd. All sales end Friday. Make sure that you show your favorite senior your appreciation. And here is Alex Roberts with our weather. Hey guys, I'm Alex with the weather, weather report for the day. Today we have a high of 75 and a low of 50 with a slight chance of thunderstorm throughout the day and about a 10 mile per hour wind. Tomorrow we have a high of 78 with a low of 53 and it looks to be relatively dry. A great day for some baseball. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks Alex. In other news, Senior Rec Day shirts for juniors are on sale for $15. You can turn the money into any class officer. Remember, a small portion of the funds will go to the prom and to the senior all-night party. Buy one today. There will be two cheer clinics on May 27th and 28th from 5.30 to 7 in the RHS Upper Gym. On Thursday, May 29th, cheerleading trials will be taking place at 3.30. There will also be a parent meeting on Wednesday, May 28th at 5.30. If you want to try out, you have to attend both clinics and the parent meeting. Now, here's Connor Velmier with your sports news. Hey, it's Connor here with your sports news. This past Friday, the boys and girls track teams were at regionals. Dominic Davis got first place in the two mile. The four by one team got first with Dylan Walsh, Damon Singleton, Brandon Sowards, and Daryl Couch. And the four by two also got first. Maggie Policic got first in the two mile. Way to bring home some golds. Good job, guys and ladies. Varsity softball played Melvindale on Friday and lost 5-2. to two. At their tournament on Sunday, they played Crestwood first round and won 12-2. to two. They advanced to the next round where they played Ida and won 5-2. to two. However, their winning streak was broken by Allen Park in the last game. The girls have a game this Wednesday at Lincoln Park. Keep it up, ladies. The end. Thanks, Connor. Happy birthday to Connor Franey, Ann Farley, Giuseppe Buscemi, Brianna Rourke, and Mackenzie. Have a great day, RHS. Remember, all you bears out there, you can't hide that bear pride. We're going to leave you with, would you rather? Would you rather, after using the bathroom, have to use a roll of toilet paper that's soaking wet, or have to use a dry newspaper? A dry newspaper. Why? What is the paper wet like? Would you rather never be able to turn away from others or cover your mouth when you sneeze or have vile, smelly, unpredictable belches? The belches one. Why?
Would you rather always look great to everyone you meet but frequently say the wrong thing or always have the right thing to say but frequently look terrible? Always have the right thing to say and look terrible. Would you rather have a career writing for a well-known controversial tabloid newspaper or have a career writing with a popular teen heartthrob magazine that specializes in boy bands? Uh, I'm doing the controversial tabloid, mag <clears throat> tabloid magazine. Why? Because I don't like boy bands very much at all. <laughs> at all? Like, at not all. Not even a little? Not even a little.